Hello everyone and welcome to the all new Simply Wall Street watch list. We're so excited to release this feature since it's been really highly requested from our users. So we just want to do a quick video run through to show you what's possible with it. Now if you've used watch list before this will all be pretty familiar to you but there's a few unique features that make ours different from the rest. So we've already got some stocks in here and to add another stock it's really quite simple. You can either do it on the company report page just underneath the company's name or down here it's as simple as clicking that add stock button and typing in a company's stock symbol or name and let's do Amazon for example. So now Amazon's in our watch list and you'll notice here that as we scroll over each stock on the right hand side here it changes and this here is the developments, the recent updates and developments of the companies that we're watching so that as we're monitoring these stocks we're able to remain on top of everything that's occurring within the underlying business. Next what makes our watch list unique is the fact that we allow you to set a fair value for each stock. Now we provide some guidance here by providing a discounted cash flow valuation that we've conducted with our own estimations and assumptions and we also provide the consensus price target from analysts that cover the stock as well. Keep in mind these are just for guidance and they should not be used as a buy or sell recommendation. You can use those to help inform your decision of a fair value or you can do your own intrinsic estimation with your own calculations. And finally, once you've been watching these stocks and you decide that one actually is at a price where you would like to buy and you're considering moving it from your watch list to your actual portfolio, you'd obviously buy it in your brokerage account and then from here to move it to your portfolio, it's as simple as clicking this right button over here and scrolling down to move to portfolio and then you can select which portfolio you'd like to add it to. So say you buy it in your US portfolio, you simply click add and Amazon has now been moved to your portfolio.